Welcome to Chamberlain College of Nursing's online classroom demonstration video series. Today we'll show you how to navigate within your course home, review your syllabus, and navigate the tabs within the course home menu. The first thing you see when you enter a course is the course home page. A best practice is to first read all the announcements. New announcements that may have been added since the last time you visited will be bolded. The first time you log in, you'll want to read the course introduction to find out what you'll be studying. On the left is the course home menu with a number of tabs that we'll discuss, followed by tabs for each week of the course. Running across the top of the classroom is a toolbar. Before you begin and during your first course, allow yourself time to explore the functionality available through your courses. Knowing where resources are located and how to use the tools will make it easier to complete your assignments. Now that we have the general layout down, let's discuss the tabs on the left in the course home menu, beginning with the course syllabus. It is very important that you review the entire syllabus as early and as often as you can as it contains information that is vital to your success in your classroom. The syllabus begins with an introduction to your professor, their contact information, the best time and methods to reach them, and a brief biography to learn more about him or her. As we scroll down, we see the section Textbooks and Resources. This lists the books and materials that are required for this course. If an ebook is required, as it often will be, there will be instructions located here for how to register for Vital Source and download your ebook, which we'll discuss in a moment. As we scroll down further, you'll notice your program and course outcomes before getting to the course schedule. It is extremely important to review your course schedule as early as you can and plan your eight week session to align with your other commitments. Knowing what readings are required, in what weeks assignments are due, and when quizzes or exams are available will help you to balance school with your life. As you scroll beyond the schedule, you'll notice further detail regarding due dates as well as the evaluation methods section. This section breaks down how many points each assignment or test is worth and how that is weighted to your overall grade. And finally, we come to the participation section. This is such an important section to review before you begin posting to your threaded discussions because it will detail precisely how many threaded discussion postings are required of you, how often you need to post, and the grading rubric used to evaluate those postings. If you're not sure what a threaded discussion at Chamberlain is, don't worry, we'll cover that in the weekly tabs and discussion threads video. I hope you can now see how important it is that you review your syllabus as early in your class as possible. Coming back to your course home menu, you'll notice the Start Here option. This provides you with a brief tutorial on how to navigate your online classroom. Start Here can also be found below the course introduction of the home page in some courses. The Policies tab provides important information on Chamberlain Classroom and College Policies. Please be sure to review the Academic Integrity Policy and other materials in this section. In Student Resources, you can access the online library and other resources. To access the library, you'll simply click into this tab once your class begins and select Library to go to the library homepage. In TutorSource, you can access and schedule online tutoring through a resource known as Smart Thinking. You may work one-on-one -on -one with an expert virtual tutor in many subjects including math, writing, and nursing subjects. Through Smart Thinking, you'll have access to many writing resources including having an expert review your papers ahead of time for proper APA format and citation. The Student Software Store allows you to shop for and purchase software at student rates. Every Chamberlain student will receive one free download of Microsoft Office from this tab. Sometimes it's easier to have a copy of your course's books in hand. For your classes using ebooks, you have the option to order a printed, soft cover copy of most ebooks. Print on demand is typically listed just above week one. This allows you to have a copy of the ebook printed and mailed to you. Once you click the tab, you'll click on Order a Print on Demand Book to place your order. All you'll need is a credit card and an address, and they'll print the book and mail it to the address you provide. If you plan to order a print on demand book, we suggest you place your order during the first few days of the week before the session begins. That's because printing and shipping of print on demand books can take 5 to 8 days and up to 14 days for APO addresses. During that time, you'll still have access to your course ebook and other course resources via your course shell. Please continue on to the next video clip in the series called Weekly Tabs and Discussion Threads. If you have any questions, please call to speak with an admissions representative.